Living a long life is for the birds. <laughs> no, it really is. Many birds live to be as old as humans, and while it may seem like a blessing, it can actually often be a curse when it comes to the feathered friends who are outliving their people parents. This morning, Local 10 animal advocate JC Birch teaches us more about these long living avians. <laughs> This bird could live up to 70 to 80 years. So I'm 38. This guy could have left me. Meet so Jose DeBasa, the bird whisperer. Your thumb. Yes. Always put it in the palm of your hand. Okay. And the president of Parrot's Haven, <laughs> the only bird rescue in South Florida. Friends, they know how, how much we love animals, and some people that couldn't take care of some of the parrots have started surrendering parrots to us. Like Marlin, this blue and gold macaw from Mexico. All right, bud. He's about 20 years old now. He's such a good boy. This guy's a, he's a hen. As for Jose, he got into the saving birds business quite by accident. And about three years ago, we purchased Captain from a pet shop. We didn't know that we were actually bringing home an endangered species from Indonesia. You heard him and right. He bought a bird bred here in the U.S. that's actually an endangered species and a product of the exotic animal trade. That would be the last animal he would ever purchase because it turns out there is a huge need to rescue birds right here because these feathered friends need a lot of training, time, affection. Oh, and some can live up to 100 years. Birds are really like all the animals we try to find new homes for. What happens? They get released into the wild because pet parents are overwhelmed and they don't know exactly what they're getting into when they get one of these guys. Hi, right? Hi. I get customers all the time that are looking for either a sanctuary or a rescue. And Patricia Lyon owns the Aviary Bird Shop in Miami and works with Parrot's Haven to help rehome unwanted birds. Birds require a lot of attention. Hello, Casper. Hello. You don't take care of them correctly. Um, <laughs> you don't give the right attention to the bird, you know? Like right now. Yeah. <laughs> he wants your attention. He wants my attention. <laughs> what no, is know. getting Jose's attention is this, a piece of property which will be called Amazon Park. And Parrot's Haven will have 6,000 square feet for an aviary to save, rescue, rehab, and adopt out surrendered birds. We were able to secure a land landing homestead where we're going to be able to move for facility and we'll be able to take in more birds. With the added goal of educating interested pet parents about their new responsibilities if they want to save one of these feathered, <laughs> friendly, and sometimes frisky and funny parrots or cockatoos or whatever bird you may like. Walk, walk, walk. JC Birch, Animal Advocate for Local 10 News.